a significant player based on the Solana ecosystem, has recently launched its own token via an airdrop, and immediately crypto community has focused their eyes on it. With his range of services for Solana users, we should expect a bright future ahead of it. So let's start with what is Gito Network. A protocol called Gito Network runs on the Solana blockchain. It makes a major contribution to the Solana ecosystem through its product collection, which are liquid staking pool and the maximal extractable value, in short MEV, and continuous access to Solana's liquidity and DeFi opportunities, users are able to exchange their Solana for Gito Sol with additional profit from the staking process. Moreover, benefits from transaction revenue related to MEV extraction on Solana are also given to Gito Sol holders. The Gito Foundation was created to increase transparency and equitably distribute profits in order to reduce the negative effects of MEV in order to establish a competitive market for MEV extraction through block-by-block -block auctions, Gito published an open-source validator client. These auctions are open to investors, and the top bidders for each block will receive the current MEV. Okay, now let's look what is a Gito Network token. The Gito Network's governance token is called JTO. The project's future is shaped by the crucial choices made by token holders who guarantee that the network will keep evolving to satisfy the demands of both its users and the larger Solana ecosystem. These choices and actions address a number of issues, including setting the fees for the Gito Sol liquid staking pool, regulating stake net program parameters to modify delegation tactics, overseeing the DAO token treasury, and advancing the ongoing development and enhancement of Gito's protocols and products. Now let's describe what services Gito Network offer. DeFi and Staking Users of Gito Network can take advantage of staking and DeFi opportunities. Gito Sol can be obtained by users by depositing Solana into the pool. Users' Solana is then delegated to authorized validators by Gito Stake Pool. These validators get paid in MEVs for auctioning off the block space. Extra APY is added to the stake pool in the form of these MEV rewards. Transaction Revenue and MEV Extraction To establish a competitive market for MEV extraction, the platform has released an open-source validator client. In order to be eligible to win the block's MEV, the client makes auctions within each block active. The highest bidder in each block may harvest the available MEV when traders place bids. Token holders have the ability to decide crucial issues for the platform with the JTO token. So, that's the end of this video. Now if you have found the content helpful, don't forget to give a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this.